Hello and welcome back. So let's play Fire Emblem 4. So yeah. This is going on right now. And that. We have a nasty 3 to 10 range spell, but that well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. For now, we really just need to move through this hellish forest. Also, before I forget, drop in here. Prepare thine weapon. And sell the skill ring that you very blatantly don't ever need ever. Right, okay. Done and dusted. So, um, yeah, I need Idine to talk to this guy. <laughs> oh boy, that's gonna be a thing, especially since he's toting a killer bow. Also, Jamka's really good. As are all the foot archers in this game. For better or for worse. As are when they're being used for or against you. This is one of the bad examples. Also a bottleneck, because despite these being worth 40 of aid, you can't walk in them at all, so... Mm, yeah. Also again, this spot, important. I should probably start moving. And yes, this is going to be slow. And very arduous. At least if I can gain them love points or something, or at least keep the other lads away for now. Or as a way as I can keep them, to be honest. I don't want to get you too close, do you? Otherwise you're probably going to bite it. Anyone need any healing, by the way? Oh, actually, yes. Doop. I will verily heal you, in fact. I kind of don't need you bleeding everywhere, I'm not going to lie. It's a bad way. Doop. Jesus! Strength and defense. That'll be good for, uh, later, shall we say. Uh, right. Onwards, then. Hi, guys. If you're gonna make it down here anytime soon. Thankfully, yes, they're just as slow as we are on that front. Once again, saving. Always saving. So, right, okay. Um... Time to get people close, but not too close. Nadine's free game, because she kind of has to... Oh, I can mend Ethlin. Thankfully, repair costs for staves aren't obscene, so... I think we're good. Oh, so while I'm on the subject, did I miss any talks? Any at all? Nope. Okay. Alright, you take a stance over here. Doop doop. Right, you bring up the rear. Sigurd gets in nice and close because he's probably the only one who can survive a shot from Jam Jamco over there. Yeah. Things are about to get dicey. Oh, bollocks, of course. I forgot they can walk on those, can't they? That's kind of dicks, isn't it? Kind of gives them massive ass of aid. Fair play to you. Saving! I would auto save, but you know, can't tell where things might go wrong with that. I might as well give those guys a target? Question mark? Get in nice and close to good, you're probably gonna want to. How's your range? Alright, you can't hit her. Yet. So good, has 10 HP off. I really need to keep checking. He's in two bars now as well, that's good. And that's a level up. Ha. Huh. Well, mostly expected, to be honest. And in turn, I'll heal you. Now, you s I know what you're thinking. I could switch to map animations for healing and whatnot. But they're not much faster. I'm not gonna lie, they they really didn't perfect the whole this is a map animation, this is a bloody um well, regular animation. Right. 
closer, closer, and closer still. So it begins. Where the hell's that guy going? Oh great, that was just committed suicide. Stellar work, day and stellar work. One has to wonder where they got their military tactics from. Probably a box of cereal. Not that they have boxes of cereal in the uh in this world, but you know. Yeah, seriously, what the hell is that guy up to? Oh well. Gotta keep an eye on Jamka's range. What's his movement? Hello? Oh, there we are. Six. Alright, I should be safe. Uh, Should probably block this off with him. Uh. Actually, yeah, that's probably a top plan, to be honest. Move her up. Plug with Sigurd. Get some nice kills on that silver sword. Sounds about right. Go and kill. And he's gone, and he's killed. Fair enough. That of course leads me to snipe at these chumps. Oh, my dear, you're still not fabulous. Much as I hate to say it. Yeah, you're not doing much better, buddy. Um, I don't know. Who should I give this kill to? Ah, Alec. Screw it. Bye-bye. Give me something good here. Ah, oh, well. Should have seen that coming. Thanks. What happened to you, man? I'll tell you what is going to happen to you. Bit of healing. Never hurt anyone. Okay. Alright, you chill up there. Move everyone you possibly can further up. Uh, except for you, do you can probably just chillax over there, to be honest. Right, bring it. Here comes contestant number one. He's dead. No, okay, so good. And the next. They still have really tiny heads. This amuses me. Oh, hi. Oh, why are you firing a killer bow at me? Oh god, it hurts! Thankfully, this has put me in perfect position. Thanks, Jamka. I mean, sure, she's... well, um, but still! Let's move you over here and get things rolling. No, it isn't. It's like he was possessed or something. No. Well, it's kind of what we've done, really, to be honest. You've kind of taken most of the country here. Yeah, about that. Screw it, let's feed him some kills. Oh, no critical? Alas. Um, yeah, pretty much. What I've got to do from here is just... Might feed Ira some kills if I can help it. Let's just 
them just at this point. I'm kind of moving everyone up. I'll heal you as well, why not? Alright. So yeah, at this point, the only real threat, uh, well, apart from these mooks, is good old Sandima there. And, well, in terms of a threat, well, you'll see. So the ones who can are going to attempt to attack Jamka, but it's not really going to go well for them. Unless you end up having the Alec effect. No, I think you're good. Yeah, we pretty much have nothing to worry about at this point. I could send him back to go do the arena, but... Meh, in all honesty, it's not too important that I do. Right, so let's have you back snipe the hell out of this guy, I guess? Why not? Not gonna, not gonna crit. Oh, he did continue. I'll take that. Thanks, Jamka. Yeah, he kind of has all of those. He's gonna keep firing if he can help it. And so go to go slaughter this hapless fool. Thicket or no, he's not surviving. Oh, also... Hi. You don't say. Yeah, about putting people in danger? Yeah, literally, as long as you've got more magic than resistance, you can do it. So it's kind of trivialized the big boss of this chapter, which is a bit unfortunate. That escalated quickly. Ah. Uh, okay. So yeah, now she's kind of here in the middle of all these assholes. That could be problematic. Uh, yeah. Also, I do, if you would, please heal, um, Ethlyn, who's kind of going to die, maybe? Probably not, but... Yeah. Okay, are we good? What is the range of magic? Not far enough. What I do need to worry about is you potentially dying. Um... Slow this guy up. Also, despite being a shaman or what have you, she uses light magic because the terminology was different. Damn, that's fabulous. Thankfully, I don't think the other ones can reach her, so she'll be good. Right, so... Eh, apparently, there's more healing to be done. Trust me, wherever I can grant experience for this shit, I will. In all honesty, some characters are more effort to get to promotion level, which in this game is 20, Cap's always at 30, so you yeah, pretty much might as well promote at 20 because it doesn't reset your level, etc, etc. So yeah, that's how the cookie crumbles in this case. Right, I think we're good. Hi. Yeah. So yeah, light magic actually, um, I think, overcomes all forms of magic in terms of sort of the triangle or the hierarchy, I suppose. Or either that or it's just neutral. I'm trying to remember which off the top of my head. Also, this gives a miracle renewal. Because miracle makes people miss when you're on low health, and renewal, well, renews you. Silent staff. Alrighty then. Also, she can't promote. As far as I'm aware, there's no point to leveling her up that much. Now or in the future, because, well, reasons. Also, are they lovers yet? Huh. 
Yeah, that really did escalate quickly. KK. Uh, tell you what then, if you can kill him, can I get a lover's critical off maybe? No, apparently not. I could look at that animation forever though. It is kind of glorious. Alas. Anyway, go and kill, etc., etc. Okay. Also, I don't think I'm pairing Jamco up with anyone this time. Unfortunate, too. Um, regardless, though. Those two lovers, yeah. Nah, probably not, let's face it. Also, I want Lex to slightly get ahead here, because, well... See, unfortunately, moving through this forest is kind of really super arduous. Naturally, they're all going to go for her, but, you know... <clears throat> two various levels of... Ow! Okay. Maybe not such varying levels of success so much as actual success, and that really hurt. Hey, it's a level up! You're terrible. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh shit, she might die this time. Ah. Of course she doesn't actually die because she's plot important. Dupe. Oh, well, miracle paid off at least, huh? And there's renewal. Basically, hacks. Alright, so keeping an eye on this asshole's range here, which isn't actually that far, but... Okay, so, tell you what, Jamka. Go and kill. Do you want to get a crit off this time? Never mind. Alright, onwards and upwards then, I suppose. Just literally get the fuck out of this forest, please. It burns us. Doop doop. And yeah, they, they kind of aren't going to come to attack us until we move within sufficient range, so right now, I'm just going to rush to get everyone the hell out of here. So, put Sigurd as the sort of general boundary. Alright. Good, this forest is nearly clear. Oh god, thank goodness. Nope. You carry on now, do you? Meanwhile, nothing happens. Deirdre heals some more. Alright, good. Um, yeah, you pop over next to Sigurd, why not? Sigurd's a lad. Oh god, get out of this fucking forest. Spirit forest be damned. Nope, don't want to return anyone, okay, thanks. That would be bad. Bloody music. Shame we can't hear it for long enough. Alright, um... Right, Lex, you start your odyssey to wherever the hell that's supposed to be. It'll be worth it, I promise. No, no healing to be done. Alas. Actually, I don't know how long the points go for lovers, so... I might try and grind them before the end of this chapter. I don't think you can, though, however. You carry on that way, Lex. You're a good lad. No returning! What did I tell you? Oh, 
god, why? It's horrible. Actually, I think it's after a certain turn that love points stop getting gained. What turn is this? 37, I thought it goes till 50. Hmm. Very well. Anyway, I'll probably stop at the end of this chapter anyway, so whether I can grind or not, I'll give you the results when I get back. Also, I'm nearly there for Lex. Might as well move you lads a bit further up, huh? Some of you aren't lads. Oh, that was weird. Computer, behave. Nothing yet. Okay, event time. And because he went over here, he dropped his axe. Hey, it's just like Zelda. Um. Okay. Now, for some reason, we have the Brave Axe. It's amazing. It makes Lex a demigod. No, literally, it's really good. But then so are all the Brave Weapons. Well, now that that's dealt with, I think we're going to shut this bastard up. Can I get close enough to do so yet? No, not yet. So let's uh, draw a bit closer. Obviously not close enough so he can bloody hit us with his magic, but you know. Like I said, close enough. Don't you dare do that. <laughs> That'll be the death of me. So yeah, time for the final battle of this chapter, as it were. It's... not fantastic. Alright, you come on back now, Lex. You're probably not going to get to participate in the great battle, but equip the fuck out of that. Oh god, it's weaker than the Steel Axe, but oh, so much better. Anyway. Now is the time, as it were. Can't really save, but eh. Uh, wait, am I still not in range? Nope, not yet. Okay. thousand gold. I was going to say give something to bloody the man, but apparently not. Alright, now for real, we're in position. Lights can come to. Right. Um, I want to put her in as little danger as I possibly can. Suck it. Also, it gives massive experience. I do like how it literally silences the entire thing. Hey, you got decent things. I still don't care. Horrible thing, woman, person, face. Whatever the case. Um, right, time to go charge the bastard. Pretty much, he's uh, silenced for how many turns? Five. All right. I'll take it. No, I don't want animation, be it real or otherwise. No, nope, you continue standing next to her. Oh, you just made the worst decision of your life. Still survived, mind you. Which is very lucky on your part, mate. Yeah, these guys, by the end of this chapter, are kind of nothing, so... Yeah. Unless they get freakishly lucky, but... We're talking for day in here. They can't even hit do. Ooh, you 
made a mistake as well. Still managed to hit. There we go. You deserve it. You got strength, I'll take it. Nope, not even mad. Right, is that the lot? Right then. Time to go massacre them and all that. And what not. Um, hmm. well, let's start with you. You're weakened, so might as well have her kill you. Plus, that animation is still to die for. Oh, oh yes. Right then. You are next. Have her kill you. Damn it. I'll have you deal with him. Okay, good. Also, you have a magic ring. Hmm. Resistance. How much magic for that do you have? 21? I can do that. Possibly. If he can get there in four turns, which I'm convinced he can't. Ah, uh, there's probably... Actually, there's probably people who'd better deal with that magic. Actually, yes, actually, there is. Never mind. Levin is the one I'm going to want to give that to. Who is that, you ask? Oh, you'll find out, won't you? Quite soon, actually. Relatively soon. Dead. And it's good. Oh, right, everyone else is here. Also, I'm not risking that for a single biscuit, so... Yes, you can still come too, Lex. So yeah, now we've just got a bunch of archers that are going to shoot haplessly at my army. And I did mean haplessly. Yeah. Oh, one of them's going for at least a smart option. Still missing, of course, but he tried. Gold star. Those guys really need to employ better archers. Alright, are we good? I think we're good. So yeah, really I'm just going to have anyone kill the boss dude and then... Uh, but we could go for a bit of karma and have Jamka end him. But yeah, that's what I'll do. So I'll clear the way, I think. It's not like he can actually do anything anyway. Because, uh... Well, silence. But, you know. Kill that guy. Nope. Exact damage, too. I like. So, yeah, it's at this point where it's just like, yeah, map's over. And it was a bloody beefy one. Ira still won't activate Astra for the life of her. You can javelin that guy, I'm sure. Good. And you're one level better for it, aren't you? I suppose. Um. Hmm. Let's see now. Right, Ethlyn, you start stabbing at this guy. Is 
Okay. That works too. Oh dear, you're pathetic, but you can kill that guy. Oh, God, Medea, no. Medea! Please. Hey, V. Harden, kill. Harden, smash. Whatever you want. Because clearly a certain someone's completely incapable of hitting someone. Ooh. Um. Soften him up a bit, dude. Take his money. Thanks. Lob a javelin at him, Finn. Kinda haven't been using you for the past episode. Oh, wow, I expect you to bite that one. Alright. And hopefully Noish can indeed finish this guy. With any luck. Nope. He didn't continue, alas. I I guess you two continue standing next to each other. Why not? And Lex, you do something over there. I don't know quite what I want you to do, but nah. Ah. You're a forest. You're about to get absolutely humiliated. Hmm. No, you don't continue. Alas. Instead, Arden claims the kill. Alrighty. Oh, also, Karmic Death. Come here. How are you talking? Owned. And that was that. A shame, he was quite intimidating with his powerful magic. Which was kind of genuinely powerful. Jump with five magic. So yeah, that's pretty much the end of the chapter. So what I'm going to do now is quickly test if I can get any more love points on this one. I think it's run dry. Or maybe it actually doesn't until turn 50, who knows. Whatever the case, I will finish this chapter by seizing next time. And we'll continue on from there. See you all then.